As a plug-in hybrid electric vehicle, Outlander PHEV relies on two different energy sources for power. It uses gasoline to power its internal combustion engine, or ICE, and it uses a 20 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery to power its twin electric motors. With plentiful battery reserve, the electric motors can do the lion's share of the work. In fact, if you stay within the electric only range of 35 miles between charging, trips to the fuel pump will be few and far between. In this video, we'll show you how to charge the battery using an external power source and consequently keep gasoline use to an absolute minimum. There are three levels of charging, level one, level two, and public DC fast charging. Level one uses a 120 volt power source like the outlets in your home. You can charge the Outlander PHEV by simply plugging the charging cable into an ordinary household outlet. If your battery is very low, a full charge may take about 16 hours. Level two uses a 240 volt power source, which can cut charging times by more than half. With this method, a full charge takes about 6.5 hours. Level 2 charging is often available at public locations such as shopping centers and parking garages. A Level 2 charging station can also be installed for home use. All Outlander PHEVs accommodate Level 1 and Level 2 charging. On SEL trims, you can also use DC fast charging. Typically found at public locations, DC fast chargers can provide Outlander PHEV with up to an 80% charge in approximately 38 minutes. The basic process for using any of these charging sources is similar. First, make sure the vehicle is unlocked, in park, and off. If you're charging at home, connect the charging cable to the charge source. To open the charge door, press and release. Now, open the appropriate charge port cover. The left port is for level one and level two charging. The right port, if equipped, is for DC fast charging. Press the corresponding tab and the cover will open. It's important to note that if you're using a DC fast charger, check that it has a compatible CHAdeMO connector. Insert the charge cable connector into the appropriate port. Once you hear it click into place, the connector will automatically lock and charging should automatically begin. To check, look for a green blinking indicator light near the charge ports. This is the charging port courtesy light. If it's any other color, the vehicle is not charging. The legend on the charge door identifies the meaning of each color. You can also check inside the vehicle. If it's charging, you'll see a blinking indicator at the bottom of the digital driver display. The vehicle does not need to be powered on to see this information. If you open a door, the display will also show the charge level and the estimated time to full charge. For added convenience, all this information is available on the My Mitsubishi Connect app. If you find that the vehicle is not charging, unplug the cable and start again. When charging is complete, the indicator near the charge ports will turn to a solid color and you'll get charge complete messages inside the vehicle and on the app. Also, the charging connector will automatically unlock, allowing you to remove the cable. If you ever need to remove the cable before charging is complete, just press the charge connector unlock switch to the left of the steering wheel. The connector will unlock and you'll be able to remove the cable. And that's how to charge the Outlander PHEV. With Outlander PHEV, you can schedule when charging takes place. This can save you a lot of money in places where electricity rates are lower on certain days and at certain times. You can schedule charging in the vehicle on the Smartphone Link Display Audio System or by using the My Mitsubishi Connect app. Here's how to do it in the vehicle. Navigate to EV on the center Smartphone Link Display. Select Charging Timer. Up to three different timers are available. Choose the one you want to set, then select the Edit button. If you need to turn off a timer, simply deselect on. Also, select timers work only at home if you want to ensure that the schedules only apply at your home. At any time, you can use the charge now button to the left of the steering wheel to cancel a charge schedule and begin charging immediately. Just connect the charge cable and charging will proceed as normal. If you don't connect the charge cable within 15 minutes, 
charging will cancel. 